it's Abby, and today I'm going to be showing you guys my three historic dolls, Molly, Kristen, and Samantha. So, these dolls are Plunge and Company dolls, which means that they are older. So, before this, the company was called American Girl, there was called Pleasant Company, founded by Pleasant T. Rowland. So, these are the three original dolls that, that Pleasant T. Rowland produced, Molly, Kristen, and Samantha. So right now they're in the or, their original meat outfits. So let's look at these a little closer. So Molly is wearing some shoes and socks. I don't think you guys can see that, but she's wearing some shoes and socks. They're just like black little flats. And she's wearing a skirt. Like that's just like a navy skirt. You can see it. And she's wearing like um, a knitted sweater with this design. And she has a little locket because in the story, her father is working overseas in World War II. So she keeps a little locket with him in it. So I don't, I don't, I don't have the picture in it, but like, but if you, but if you just, it just opens, there's no pic, I don't have the picture inside, but it's, this one just opens like this. And I have her hair braided with her original bow, with her original ribbons in her hair which are just red ribbons to match her outfit. And she's wearing her silver steel rim glasses. So that's Molly's original outfit. Kristen over here, let me just move Molly out of the way so we can see Kristen. So Kristen's meat outfit comes with, well the original one comes with a blue dress. I don't know if you guys can see it kind of has like a flower print on it. And she has her apron and it has a little pocket right here. You can put something in it. Let me just show you guys. It's got a little pocket right here. Um, let me turn it forward so I can see you. And it's got, so this is the apron. It goes like, it just ties in the back of her dress. And right now she's actually just wearing some black shoes. Um, it's Since she's an older doll, it's kind of difficult to find shoes that'll fit her because in the past, um, they had American, the Pleasant Company made the feet larger and the skin like a different texture than the, the smooth or skinnier feet doll that they have today. So when I put all my modern shoes to try to put on Kristen, they didn't really fit. So I had to try to find some shoes that might fit her. So they're just black flats on her feet right now. But, so this is the apron and she has a little bonnet. So it's like a red checkered bonnet. This is like, and it ties on the neck on the bottom here. So this is Kristen's original meat outfit. Um, I actually have her hair in like little braided loops that the original Kristen usually wears, that she usually comes with. So if you guys want to learn how to do that, there's probably a video online. Maybe I'll make one showing how to do this faded loop, but that's Kristen. So let's look at Samantha. So Samantha over here is wearing her original meat outfit. So she's wearing black stockings or tights. Okay, but you can't really see it. Give me a little bit. Okay, there. So you can see she's wearing the just black stockings. And she has this like flat a checkered dress it has like some light blue some white some black and some red and in the middle it's tied with a red ribbon um with like a, a metal clasp to keep it from falling um so that's kind of her dress it's got like balloon sleeves like this and her sleeves here tie with uh, are like closed with velcro so in her hair, she's wearing a half up, half down um, ponytail. So it has this ponytail here and like some hair down here. This is her original hairstyle. So those are her meat outfits. Tell your doll is an original Pleasant Company doll because she'll have a special neck stamp on the back of her neck underneath her hair. So I'll show you guys Samantha. Samantha here, you just open here, you can kind of see. It says Pleasant Company as opposed to American Girl. You can kind of see it. Let me show you. So you can see it kind of says 
pleasant company on the back. So that's how you know she's a pleasant company doll. Let's show you. So this is um, Blair Wilson. She's Girl of the Year 2019, so she's a very recent doll. And at the back of her neck, the neck stamp says American Girl. And my camera is not focusing for me, but it does say American Girl. See? So opposed to Pleasant Company. So that doesn't mean your doll's fake, it just means that she is an older, much rarer doll than your average, than your new pleasant, than your new American Girl dolls. So next I'm going to talk about the body tag. So this is a brand new, this is Blair. So she's Girl of the Year 2019. So she actually has a really long body tag she's newer so any doll that is newer or is released later than 2011 and later is going to have this long tag this is kit so kit was released in 2000 so she actually but this kit was made before 2011 so she actually has a medium body tag that says made in china 2008 and this is Samantha. So Samantha is a Pleasant Company doll, and she's older. The way I can tell because her he doesn't have a body tag at all. Like there's not even a place where she was cut, where they cut it or something. Because sometimes if people cut it, it could mean they're fake, or they just don't want to hold up, or they just don't want the tag. But since she doesn't have a tag at all, then she's older than two thousand. Another way to tell that your doll is older is by looking behind their ears. So. This is Molly. She's also a Pleasant Company. If you look behind her ear, there is a little mark right here. You guys can kind of see it. It's like a little mark there. It's called an artist's mark. So most Pleasant Company dolls will have one. But if you look at a newer doll, like I was showing you, Blair, does not have an artist's mark around that, around, on her, under her ear. See? It's just completely blank skin. So if your doll has a watermark or an artist mark, it is probably she's probably a pleasant company doll hey there guys thank you so much for watching please click like and subscribe i hope this was helpful to see if you guys have a pleasant company doll see you guys next time bye